Howdy y'all, it's Texas Rue here. I'm actually pretty excited to share this video with you. As you can tell if you've ordered from me in the past, I take great pride in my packaging. Um, everything that is shipped with the package is biodegradable. From the packaging material to the box that it's shipped in is all biodegradable. So here's a photo of what you would normally see when you're making substrate. So this is the cardboard box that you can use uh, from the product that we ship. From, uh, from Melbourne. So here we go, it's just kind of my little substrate recipe. There is a video that I have with my substrate. So what I've done here is actually broken apart into pieces the cardboard box, and then also there should be some cellophane wrap you'll see here in the video as well. Every syringe is actually uh, encased in a cellophane wrap. And if you didn't know, cellophane is actually biodegradable. So what I've done from here is actually put that into my substrate um, with the choir and the vermiculite and a little bit of horse manure as well. So I went in and added the cellophane wrap in this next photo. So you can actually easily use some scissors or tear it apart with your hand. It's actually pretty easy to, um, to tear apart. And then this next video here, excuse me, the next photo here shows the choir block that I put inside there. Actually, probably the uh, substrate I had inside there before was left over from my previous grows. So anyhow, just added that inside there, add the water. <clears throat> and then this video here just kind of shows me mixing it up. So I'm going to stay quiet uh, while this video goes. I'm going to do it in fast forward just because uh, there's a whole lot of nothing. Nothing exciting to see but mixing up from here. So stay quiet till we get to the next video and we'll go from there. Okie dokie. All right, as you can tell, that's pretty much the mixed up substrate. It can, has the cardboard and it also has the cellophane wrap. One thing I do want to stress is that if you do take this route to use the packaging materials, uh, please make sure you put it in a pressure cooker for at least two and a half hours. If you're doing the bucket method where you're adding boiling water to the bucket, um, it may not actually work as well for you because you may get some contamination if that does happen. Also, another question I have for the group out there is if you have a different method that you can use, uh, you can send me uh, to not use the plastic that we use in the syringe please put that in the comment section below. I'm actually looking for a different delivery method as this is the only kind of plastic that I use in my entire packaging material. So guys, I hope you have a fantastic day and you be kind to everybody else and take care. Bye-bye.